This year's Dirty Dozen, a list from Environmental Working Group, has been released. The list shows the 12 grocery products most contaminated by pesticides. Robin Christensen has the full list. Robin, what is at the top of this list? Strawberries were ranked number one on the Dirty Dozen list, meaning they were found to be the most contaminated with pesticides. The Environmental Working Group, or EWG, analyzes data from the FDA and Department of Agriculture on testing of nearly 50,000 samples of 46 different fruits and vegetables. The produce are ranked and sent out in a list called A Shopper's Guide to Pesticides and Produce. Produce manager of Sprouts and Spanish Fork, Tyler Caldwell, says that he hasn't been affected by the pesticides. It's usually a romaine lettuce, like around December, we'll get E. coli outbreaks. <laughs> That's, that's pretty much it. <laughs> we have to throw away all the salad. Besides strawberries, the Dirty Dozen for 2023 includes spinach and kale, which Tyler says they do have a problem with occasionally. The old stuff off, I mean it's old, but it's still fine. It's like a day old. And then we put the new stuff underneath and the old stuff on top, so people buy that first just to keep it fresh. On the other end, the EWG also releases a Clean 15 list with the produce least contaminated by pesticides. This year's Clean 15 include avocados, onions, pineapple, and sweet corn. Tyler says the biggest thing they do for quality control is rotating the fruits and vegetables. He also says that the customers who get upset over produce are usually looking for organic fruits and vegetables. Usually they're just having a bad day. The EWG says they test the fruits and vegetables for pesticides after they've been prepared the way they would be at home, meaning washed and when needed, peeled. Reporting in Provo for Universe Live, I'm Robin Morris Christensen. Thanks, Robin.